Hello there, folks. Today, I'm diving into a case that gripped the world and had the internet buzzing. It's a story filled with twists and turns, a real-life murder mystery that left everyone in shock. I'm talking about the chilling case of Elisa Lam. Elisa Lam was a 21-year-old student from Vancouver, bright, young and full of dreams. In January 2013, she decided to take a solo trip to Los Angeles. She checked into the infamous Cecil Hotel, a place with a dark history. What happened next would become the subject of countless theories and online discussions. On January 31st, Elisa disappeared. The LAPD launched a massive search, and then the hotel released the infamous elevator footage. Have you seen it? Elisa is behaving erratically, pressing buttons and looking like she's hiding from someone. Her strange actions and the eerie vibe sent chills down the spines of viewers worldwide. Weeks went by with no sign of Elisa. Tensions were high, and then hotel guests started complaining about the water. It tasted funny, it was discoloured. Maintenance went to check the tanks, and there, in one of the tanks, they found Elisa's body. The internet exploded. How did she end up there? Theories ranged from murder to paranormal activity. The autopsy report was inconclusive. No signs of trauma, but her death was ruled an accidental drowning. Skeptics weren't convinced. The Cecil Hotel had a reputation. It was home to serial killers, a hotspot for suicides and mysterious deaths. Elisa's case only added to its infamy. People started connecting dots, creating elaborate stories. It was a real-life puzzle that no one could solve. Elisa's story is more than just a mystery. It's a reminder of the struggle she faced with her mental health. She documented her battles online, hoping to find solace. Her tragic end raised awareness about the importance of mental health care. So what really happened to Elisa Lam? We may never know. But her story continues to haunt us, a ghost in the digital age. It captivated millions and became a dark chapter in internet history. Remember, true crime fans, sometimes the scariest stories are the ones that actually happened. Stay curious, stay safe, and always question the shadows. That's all for today. If you enjoyed this story, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more spine-chilling tales. Until next time, stay vigilant.